Hey everyone and welcome to the club and welcome to another weekend or challenge. Today I'll be fusing Cuddle Team Leader from Fortnite with Deadpool. Now if this is your first time at the club, make sure that you hit that subscribe button to get access to all my lessons and community feed. So we're going to get started with the eyes. Moving up to the top of our page, on the left side we're going to draw in a circle. Starting from the top, let's work our way around to the bottom and then back up towards the top. Now we're going to leave a large gap in the center and do the same thing on the right. So let's line up the top of the eye and draw in that same size circle. Now along the bottom edge of the eye, we're going to move towards the center and draw on the nose. So it's a heart shape. We're going to start with a point in the middle. We're going to curve up and out towards the left, round out the side of the heart, and then come down an angle towards the bottom. Now let's go back to the top and do the same thing along the right side. From here, we're going to draw on the cheeks coming down towards the chin. So on the left eye, we're going to step out. Start out here, we're going to curve out. Round out the cheek. Now we're going to curve down and in towards the chin. Now we're going to work our way back up towards the right side. Going out, rounding out the cheek, and then coming in. Now we're going to move all the way up towards the top of the head, right in the middle. Right up here, we're going to start with a point. We're going to curve the side of the head coming down towards the cheek. We're going to curve out, round out the side of the head, and then pull that in towards the cheek. Now let's go over to the left side. Now this curve, we're going to go all the way around, up above that line towards the right side. So start out here, we're going to curve out. And we're going to start to pull that in towards the top. We want to make sure we clear the top point in the center. And then go over towards the right. Now we're going to curve this down and in behind this line. Let's go in and add the trim around the eyes. So in the center, we're going to leave a gap, draw two points right in the middle on the left and right. From this point, we're going to curve up and out over the eye. Going up to right above there. We'll do the same thing on the right side. Curving up and then out. From the top point, I want to curve out and down in between the side of the cheek and the eye. Curve out. I'll go in between. Now we're going to pull that in. Let's do the same thing on the right side. Curve out in between and then down. Now we're going to connect these two points with a curve, just coming down underneath the eye. Curving around and then up. From these two top points, we're going to draw a little trim. Starting from the left side, we're going to go up and just curve that in towards the top of the head. Do the same thing on the right side. Now let's go to the bottom and curve down coming down and in towards the chin. Now at the top of the head, we're going to add the ears. So it's almost like a large half circle. Starting from the top of the head, we're going to curve out, round out the ear, and then pull that in towards the side of the head. We'll take that and flip it over on the right. So let's line this up, curve it up, rounding out the ear, and then coming back in. Now we're just going to trace this out along the inside, leave an even space gap. And then from the bottom tip of the nose, we're going to come straight down towards the chin. Okay, so we've drawn the head, let's work our way down the body. I'm going to start with the side of the body first. On the left side, we're going to curve out and then down towards the hip go in the opposite direction on the right side. Now let's connect these two points with a curve. Coming down and then back up. We're going to step up and draw that same curve to the top of the belt. Let's add the buckle. Leaving a gap in the center, we're going to draw two straight lines. One on the left and then one on the right. Now we're going to move out and draw in the belt loop. So two straight lines side by side. Now in the center of the body, we're going to add a large heart. So right in the middle, we're going to start with a point. From this point, I'm going to curve up, round out the side of the heart, and then come down just above the belt buckle. Let's go back to the center and do the same thing on the right side. 
Now we're gonna draw two straight lines coming down the center, leaving a gap along the top and bottom. Start on the left side, and then the right. Now we're gonna trace out the heart along the left side here, leaving an even spaced gap coming down towards the bottom. Do the same thing on the right side. Now we're gonna add a couple eyes on either side. On the left, we're gonna add an angled line coming down. Do the same thing on the right. Now we're gonna connect these two points with a curve coming down and up. Do the same thing on the right side. Now we're gonna fill the inside areas in black. Let's go in and add a shoulder strap. So from the side of the body, we're gonna step in, curve down, and then out towards the side of the body. Do the same thing on the right side. Now up in the about halfway down here, we're gonna draw an angle line coming down and in. And then along the top, add a small circle for a button. Let's continue working down with the legs. In the center, we're gonna step down, draw a curve from left to right, going up, and then back down, leaving a gap in the center on the left side. We're gonna curve out and down towards the left heel, and then the right heel. Let's round out the bottom of the feet. So from heel to toe, we're gonna to curve down and up towards the toe. Now we're gonna draw on the top of the foot. From the toe, I wanna to draw almost like a half circle aiming towards the heel, but we're not gonna go all the way. We're gonna curve up and stop right about there. Now let's go back up to the hip and draw on the side of the leg. From the left hip, we're gonna curve out, round out the knee, and then curve back in towards the top of the foot. Now moving back down, we're gonna draw on the sole. Taking this curve, we're gonna step up. We're just gonna duplicate that all the way across on both sides. And then let's add a toe cap. At the top of the foot, we're gonna curve in and then down towards the sole. Now just above the foot, we're gonna add the edge of the boot. Starting on the left, we'll curve down and up towards the inside of the leg. Do the same thing on the right side. Now we're just gonna add a trim along the side of the body. So underneath the strap, on the left side, we're gonna curve down towards the belt, just following the same curve of the body. Do the same thing on the right side. Now I just wanna continue this down underneath the belt. We're gonna follow the curve of the leg, going out, and then down to right about there, leaving a gap. Do the same thing on the right side. Now we're gonna follow the same edge of the boot going in. Let's add two pouches on the side of the hip. From the top corner of the belt, we're gonna step up, draw a straight line going across. We're gonna come down towards the leg, and then we'll just pull that in. Let's take that and flip it over on the right. Now let's go out and draw on the arms. From the bottom of the strap, we're gonna curve out around that pouch and then down. Let's go back to the left side and draw on the thumb. Draw a small half circle. Now at the end of the thumb, we'll draw a small bracket. At the bottom curve of the thumb, we're gonna come down and then up around the bracket. Now we're gonna add two more fingers. Stepping down, curve down and up the second finger. Now on the side of this finger, we're gonna curve out the hand, and then we'll curve that back in just underneath the head. Let's do the same thing on the right side. Starting with the thumb, add a bracket. At the bottom of the thumb, we'll curve down and up around the bracket. Add in the second finger. Now the third finger, just on the side here, we're gonna curve out and up, and again, we're gonna pull this up underneath the head. Let's add the cuff of the sleeve. From the wrist on the inside, we're gonna curve up and then down towards the outside of the arm. We'll step up and just follow that same curve coming back in. Do the same thing on the right. Now we're gonna add a trim along the shoulder. Just about halfway down the strap, we're gonna curve up and out towards the side of the arm. 
Now the last thing we're gonna do is add the bow in behind the body. Starting from the top of the arm, we're gonna curve up and then out. Now we're gonna angle this down and in behind the arm. Going down and in. Now just on the side of the pouch, we're gonna draw a straight line going out towards the inside of the arm on both sides. And that's pretty much it. There we have it. There's our fusion between Cuddle Team Leader and Deadpool. I hope you enjoyed today's lesson. Make sure you subscribe and send me your requests in the comments below. Thanks for watching and we'll see you again soon.